couldn't believe it was the same guy. But then they said he had a birthmark on his back. How can a guy kill his own kids? Good question. The booker said Gilman was your regular client? Okay, look, I only do therapeutic oil massage. Rub, no tug, feel me? I'm feeling the stiletto heels. Hey, Jules, we're not here to bust your chops about your sex work. We just want to catch Gilman, okay? Tell us what he was like with you. He was shy. First time he didn't even take off his t-shirt and shorts. He didn't want any extras, just a massage. After, he said he wouldn't be back. Guess who showed a week later? He wasn't so shy the second time. You have sex? Uh-huh. He came by every week. Massage and sex. If I wasn't available, he'd wait. Always, he'd say, that's it. He was never coming back. Because he felt guilty? He said if his wife found out, he'd lose his family. But he kept coming back. He was like, why fight it? People always leave him anyway. Yep, like that. I got a hit on the phony IDs. By the way, Jules, Gilman was taking an antibiotic for an STD, so you take care of yourself. I promise, I double and triple checked. So what you're telling me is it's the same address. This blogger lives right here. Apartment 4D. It's not a coincidence. First thing you're gonna do, gently pull out the ends of the blue wires. I have purple, yellow, green, red. Teal, do we have teal? Is periwinkle an option? Okay, okay, I'm on it. You see a wire, orange and white, but entwined? Pull that out. Yes, I have orange and white. Now attach the wires to the scrambler chip. Is that it? That's it. Stop fire apart! You said a lot of to report fire. You said it's a 1213 West 11th Street. Uh, yeah, it's, it's my, it's my neighbors. You see, there's, um, there's babies in there. I... <laughs> there's been an explosion. To get in so bad, he broke the windows with a tire iron, but the fire just blew that glass back at him. I never seen a man cry so hard. He just stood there with this strange look in his eye. That's total bullshit. Did Todd Willingham ever make an attempt to get back in that house? He was too worried about that car of his. He didn't try to save those kids till the cops showed up. And it was like he was putting on a show. I just hear you two are new. Welcome to Kentucky. Thank you. Yeah, just uh, moved out from L.A. with my husband. L.A.? Wait, Danny? Yeah. Oh, it, it's a small town. I heard he moved back. I'm Sarah. Allie. Ooh, I love your mood ring. Thank you. According to this, I'm always in a good mood. <laughs> I, I went to school with Danny. I was so sorry to hear about his mom. She was so great. Wasn't she amazing? She used to come in here every Sunday after church. She would always get the hot, hot brown. brown. Oh. Jinx, buy me a Coke. <laughs> Gertie, a night to remember, except, and here's the catch, with a K for a medieval theme. Yeah. But with a K. Kurt, do you got anything? Putting on the Ritz. Putting on the Ritz, yeah. I like that, because it's simple. Oh, fine. Wait, wait, wait. What happened? Did you forget to compliment Kelly's purse? <laughs> yes. Uh, OK, phone. Here is my number. I am officially your friend, and I am awesome. So call or text me anytime. Ah, but no emojis, OK? I hate those things. Little weird faces. Yeah, they really creep me out. <gasps> me too. See, I knew we were going to be BFFs. Sarah, I hope I didn't, I don't know, hurt your feelings. No, and to reiterate, he barfed on my shoes. That's my charming man. <laughs> yeah, I, I know you want to fit in. And you will, honestly. I promise. 
you will find what's important to you here. Just don't change to fit in, huh? Tell Mr. Colby we're making every effort to settle his father's estate expeditiously. I don't know how much longer I can keep him leashed before he sues. You might consider replacing his leash with a choke chain. Go, Kelly. Oh, thank you so much. We'll take care of it. Thanks. Why, Kelly, you look lovely. Thank you, Miss Sally. It's, it's so wonderful to see you again. Have you found Mr. Wright yet? Still looking. Oh. No keepers yet. <laughs> well, thank you. Why? You want them? With the trees? What else? You don't like me, do you, Kelly? Do you care, Mr. Anderson? You're different off the clock. <laughs> uh, all right, how about you take that one and I'll get the other one? Oh, I get it. You want the big one. Is that all right with you? No, no, that's fine. I prefer the small, feisty ones. Mm -hmm. 